Setting the layer line weight. Let's go up to the layers property dialog box. And you can see in our line weights, they're all listed as default. We want to give it a particular line weight to match our particular uh, layer standards or our line our line conventions. So the first thing we want to do is we're going to come down and highlight the object lines. We're going to click on line weight and you can see that down here and in the ASME we have two different line weights and that's I call thick and thin and thin is 0 0.30 millimeters and thick is 0 0.60 millimeters. And so I say OK and I switch this to 0 0.60 mil millimeters. Also, I can click on the hidden. The hidden is 30 millimeters. But I also know that my uh, center line and my text and my dimensions are all going to be 0.3 millimeters. So I can click on all three of them at once, pick on 0.30 millimeters, and all of them will update. And I know my chain actually is 0 0.60. So I can come down here and add that one in. So I can set these up any way I like. And then I can hit the close. And you can see that the line thicknesses didn't really change. And that's because by default, the line settings don't show our line weight. To show them, we have to put in a system variable called line weight. And we hit enter. And right now we are listing things in millimeters. If you want to read them in inches, you switch to inches. But here's where we turn on the display line weight. We have a slider bar which can slide it back so we can visually see our line weight more or less. When we say OK, you'll notice now that my thick line is my object line and my object lines are the drill holes and my thin lines are things like my center line, my hidden line, my dimensions and my notes. Another way of doing this is I can go over to my st status bar I can go to line weight, turn that on and then I can show my line weight on or off. You can also right click on it and go to the line weight settings. Remember I can adjust the slider bar and I can say OK. And that just shows us a little less line weighting. If I go back up into my layer properties, remember I switched it to inches, not in metric. So really the thick lines in inches are 24 thousandths and the thin lines are 12 thousandths. So typically the standard for mechanicals to work in millimeters um, but just so you know when we work in architecture we'll flip this back so um, so I can go back in type in line weight hit enter I can say I want to go back to millimeters you can see the list shows up here I want to display the line weight or not say OK and now I can see the line weights uh, of my layers. And these line weights will plot as well. So I can control the color, the line tape type, and the line weights. Those are known as layer properties. I can control those with, our, with my layers. I can change them at any time if I, if I wish.